All right, Spirit, what do we have for today? So right off the bat, um, I'm picking up an energy that... It feels like a karmic energy that's very impatient, very frustrated. I just feel, I feel a lot of anger, very, a very tense energy. I feel like somebody's very, very impatient. Okay. And it, it almost feels like it has something to do with money or somebody else's money. Somebody's upset, mad because you're not paying their bills anymore. You're not giving them money. You're not sharing your money. You're not sharing your wealth to whoever this is. Okay, let's see. What else is here? Um, show me this energy, please, spirit. I feel, I feel like this is some impatience over money um, or stability or some type of security. Saturn. Eighth house. Could be a Scorpio. Dealing with a Scorpio. Capricorn. Yeah, using other people's resources. Yeah, this is out. Yeah, this is. Oh my God, this is what I'm picking up. Um, Somebody is really concerned about your money or your resources. I feel like whoever this is, you could have gave this person money in the past. Um, this could have something to do with a loan also. This person's pissed off. Someone's, somebody's bills are overdue, really past due. Yeah, this is Scorpio energies out again. Eighth house is Scorpio, Scorpio. Could be some sort of secret being hidden. Also, this person is not telling you or you're not telling whoever this is. You could have definitely put an end to something with this person. Put on the brakes, somebody put on the brakes with the situation with whoever this is, or you've imposed some sort of limit. Okay. Could have been giving your power away to this person or people, but there's a major change here. Um, and I really feel like somebody's pissed off. I, I, they're giving me, this is mainly about somebody's money. Okay. They're giving me your money. This is somebody's money. They want your money or to use your, your, um, they thought you were going to continue to give them your wealth or share your, your wealth with them or you were going to continue to pay their bills or help pay their bills, loan them money, okay? Maybe you were sending this person money. Um, somebody owes somebody a lot of money also is what I'm getting. And this energy is very angry, frustrated. They don't want you to know that they're frustrated and, and impatient though. This person could have recently reached out to you or you guys could have had a conversation recently. Somebody's mad also because you're rejecting them. You're rejecting their phone calls, rejecting messages or giving me messages. Somebody tried to Facebook messenger, contact somebody on Facebook messenger. Okay, tell us more about this energy. I feel like somebody imposed a limit here on something or made a change with whoever this energy is. Saturn. Yeah, there's a message right there, message of concern. This is out as a reversal. So somebody's not concerned. This person could have reached out to you recently, like I said, but I feel like it's a message or whatever communication this is, I feel like it was rejected. Or I just feel like you're not interested. Like, you don't give a fuck. You're like, it's not my fucking problem. That's what I feel like. Move this over here. Eight 
Eighth house, show me this about somebody else's, this person is pissed off or mad, impatient about somebody else's money, resources, or wealth. They're mad because your ass ain't paying their damn bills no more. It could be a, a masculine, mature man, reverse. This could be a masculine, also mad, upset, and immature man. I see maturity here, though. Somebody's matured from a situation or with this person or people, this group, this circle. You could have gray hair or dealing with somebody with gray hair, an older person. This could have been you. You could have been immature in the past and you've made a change. Um, Scorpio, they want control of the situation or control over your resources, money. Whatever else you know, but I see wealth though. They want control over your wealth. Some of you guys um, are married or recently married could have recently divorced this person or this person is divorced um, great fortune reversed yeah they thought they was gonna get a hold or control your your money your um, your fortune okay and they're pissed off about that <laughs> um, okay somebody could work at the casino also or um okay let's continue let's see what's here this energy is really really angry message of concern reversed yeah i feel like you don't even give a fuck and I feel like they know you don't give a fuck either about their bills or whatever money, whatever um, responsibilities. Somebody just got paid and they spent all their paycheck already. All their paycheck is going to some bills and they're broke. Somebody also has to move um, back home with a parent or um, their mother could be a grandmother for some of you guys this energy I don't get along with my mother so maybe this is a mother I see baby mama drama too somebody don't get along with their mother expect a call from me soon this person could have recently called you or getting ready to um, soon I admire you is on the other side I feel like you're also trying to just refocus your energy away from whoever this is or these people. However, many people are um, attached and dependent upon your wealth. Manipulation. Yeah, this person definitely um, could have been manipulating you or trying to manipulate you. Manipulation. I could not tell what was real and what was not until I realized I was being manipulated. So I feel like, <clears throat> excuse me. I feel like you realized you were being manipulated. I can't afford my car yet. Yeah, this person's really behind on some bills. This person's living really um, beyond their means. Could have kicked this person to the curb or left them out in the cold, neglected the situation altogether. They can't afford their car. Somebody can't afford their car. Karmic, stop trying to act like my mom. Somebody's karmic. Karmic is trying to force their way in right now. This this energy is very forceful, very impatient, very entitled. And one more for this message of concern. I'm coming towards you very soon. They're um, really concerned you're going towards somebody else. I really feel like that's um, somebody going towards somebody else. 
This is what a karmic energy is concerned about. Could have something to do with somebody's uncle also. Okay, the answer is no. Okay, you could have told this person no, but I feel like they just don't, they're not understanding that you're not gonna share your wealth with them or you're not gonna share your wealth with them anymore. This person is very, it feels like they're very stubborn. They're real hard-headed. It's their way or the highway, it feels like to me. Eighth house, show me this eighth house energy. person definitely was taking advantage of you in the past. I see codependency issues. I became too ungrounded and too unfocused on what truly matters. I cared way too much about money and material things. I got too greedy, too ruthless, and I cared too much about status. I am so embarrassed by my karmic now. You could have been doing um, shady things for money in the past, shady business doing um, things you know were wrong in the past regards to money or trying to get money or to hustle for money for this energy. I feel like you're changing that. You could be transforming something in regards to your business, finances, career, or your wealth. Could be suddenly winning the lottery or um, some um, gift or sudden wealth wealth here there's a major change it looks like a change in power also admired hot and cold you deserve so much more than my confusing behavior Whoever this is, is just repeating the same cycles over and over and over. They're not maturing. They're not trying to, um, I feel like this energy is not trying to hustle. They're not trying to do what they need to do. Um, as far as resources, money, okay. We'll see what else comes out when we pull the tarot. I regret letting other people come in between us. I've already made up my mind to leave you behind. Could be leaving that person or people behind. There is a family dynamic that is currently breaking down. Somebody in your family could be a shopaholic or a big spender, always wanting to spend money, or it looks like your money, your resources, beginning to get your health back. I've seen that out recently too. Um, improvement in health. I am so resentful about my karmic right now. I'm not communicating much to them. Somebody cannot handle their emotions. They are gonna get fucked up and get wasted tonight. Okay, this person could definitely be real reckless. Okay, this person secretly watches Tarot to spy on you. I know I stress out Divine Masculine, but I truly do not care. So this person, they don't even care. Um, let's get a couple more cards for um, the Scorpio energy, sudden well. Somebody smokes a lot of weed also. Somebody doesn't want to have to give up weed. Somebody doesn't want to have to go look for a new job also or apply themselves. Scorpio, sudden wealth. Fears of coming together. Resolve doubts and be more open to love with your twin flame. When I said it was over, I do not know what the hell I was thinking. There's also a transformation in a connection, a relationship. Getting the results that you had hoped for. I'm afraid I'm going to lose you. 
definitely an ending with whatever karmic this is and transforming whatever area in your life this is for you or with whatever other connection you have outside of this bravery it is now time to stay positive be strong and allow yourself to move forward let's get uh one more a secret is about to be revealed so okay Show me this angry person, angry today, or they recently have been. Maybe they've been moody. They're real impatient. Devil is trying to come out. Very uh, controlling. Yeah, you've been isolating yourself or withdrawn from this person. This person's going to learn. They're going to have to learn to be more independent. Okay. Seven of Cups. They're trying to cause some sort of confusion so you can help juggle. This is somebody that always needs help financially. They can't ever juggle things on their own. Okay, this is, feels like a very needy energy. Very, very needy. Six of Wands. Okay. Okay, show me. Somebody doesn't get along with their mother. Yeah, there's the, they're pissed off. Somebody's got to move back home with their mother or their parents that they don't get along with or some motherly energy. Somebody's um, getting ready. Yeah, anger's here. Ang this could be an angry um, feminine energy or a woman. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. They don't want to have to make any type of compromises. Okay, yeah, this energy is really entitled. They feel like you owe them something. This could be somebody in your family or a relative somebody's getting ready to move they've been fighting off they've been fighting off for dear life from having to move or move out or relocate they've got trouble coming up ahead for them this could have something to do with a home house could be losing a home house stability of their foundation i see a very very angry feminine energy um, Divine Feminine, this could be somebody in your family angry with you, Empress, or this is just um, somebody that's putting themselves first. You're putting yourself first. This is self-love, self-care, paying yourself first. You're no longer allowing whoever this is to be a priority. Um, I feel like this there was some financial abuse here or abusing your generosity taking for granted taking advantage is what I'm hearing taking for granted took you for granted this is a very selfish energy they're very um, could be definitely a narcissist narcissistic energy they're all about themselves it's all about them they're really, this person's very pissed off, angry. They don't want to have to do anything or put any work. This person could have um, recently tried to have sex with you as a way to, for you to give them money uh, for their bills. But this is somebody that's getting ready. You could be pissed off with your mom, okay? But I feel like this is somebody that's pissed off and is getting ready to move um, to a parent's house or mother's house, grandmother, something of that nature. Spirit, is this somebody getting ready to move to a, um, a mother's with their mom or... Knight of Swords, Knight of Wands, Reverse, Six of Swords, Reverse. Yeah, they are. Okay, they are. They're fighting this. They're fighting to not have to move or travel or relocate. Something with their mom or mother figure. This person hates their mom. Knight of Wands, Reverse. They're pissed. They're frustrated because you're rejecting them or you're rejecting communication. I see a feminine energy here that is really trying to get... um someone's attention or a masculine's attention you're just rejecting this person somebody's rejecting them ace of swords okay because you know some sort of truth and they know you know the truth about something hey what is this ace of swords please you're thinking for yourself now and this person's pissed off about that 
gosh, I mean, this person that's pissed off, they have to move or move with their mother or something like that, the family. Ace of Swords, you're rejecting them or they feel rejected. Yeah, this per whoever this is, is they're jealous, it says. Could be an ex for some of you guys or jealous person from your past. There is a big secret being hidden. They're hiding a lot and there's a secret again. Um, but it's going to come out soon if it has not already. They're hiding a lot from you. They're hiding the fact that they're getting bad karma right now. They don't want you to know they're getting bad karma. They are. They want you to assume their debts or their financial responsibilities. Yeah, this is the energy that I was picking up on when we started the reading. Very hostile energy. Um, okay, let's get into this. We're going to dive deep today. Okay, show me. Um, what is this? The um, Ace of Swords. They know you know something. It, is this person recently tried to four cups? Yeah, they're trying to get a hold of you or something like that, but it was unsuccessful. And it's pissing them off. They're trying also for some of you guys, they're trying to convince you to move on from some Empress energy, a divine feminine energy, if they know of this this um, other person. Okay, it could be a, a mother involved, baby mama, or I see a pregnant woman here in the card. Some of you guys are pregnant or there's a time of fertility here for you guys. King of Wands. Yeah, because you're standing your ground. You could be a painter, designer, do artwork or involve with somebody like that. But you're harnessing your power. King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. You're standing strong. You could have been real weak, um, weak-minded before in the past. Let this person rock you, control you. This is what it feels like. I feel like it's like no more Mr. Nice Guy. This is what this energy feels like. You got your back turned towards whoever this angry person is. They don't, this person hates their mom is what I'm getting. So you look like you're standing firm in your beliefs with this energy. Okay, why else is this energy mad? Ace of Swords. Because they've hit rock bottom in their life. They're getting ready to lose it all. Um, this person, unfortunately, the only way they're going to learn, um, this person's facing harsh, painful endings in their life right now. They're, they've hit rock bottom. It just can't get any worse for them. They feel like they know you're completely done with the situation. It's completely inevitable. This is an inevitable end of a situation. I feel like it's you're done with the money. But they're not understanding that because they're still trying to create some drama or... Um, compete with somebody it looks like they're competing with an empress energy they're they still feel like there's some sort of competition they want to fight they want to create arguments there's too many hands in the pot here and they want to stir up conflict they want to stir up drama six of swords somebody's fighting off a change or um, trying to fight you from moving on moving forward this person don't want to have to move or travel something to do with a mother figure or their mom five of wands this energy please they're trying to fight off some sort of truth yeah you're not ten of wands reversed you're like no i don't give a fuck about your bills i'm not paying your fucking bills this person doesn't understand that for some reason you could be making divine feminine this could be somebody you know or friends family um, or somebody your person's attached to. Here's Pisces energy, hanged man. King, queen of pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. This person thought this, whoever this was, thought that they was going to get um, some ten of pentacles energy or some wealth and have your person kick you to the side and have your person feel asked out in life or something of that nature um, and sacrifice you. But this energy is getting left out in the cold. They're not understanding that they keep fighting against some, some situation that's over, done and over with. This could just be the end of the relationship. You guys know what the, what this complete end is. This is an end. You can't come back from this. 10 of wands reverse. Yeah. You're not worried about their, their issues. They're just going to have to move. Is this, so this person's moving to a mother or their mother? Mm-hmm. Seven of Wands reversed. They've got they're trying to fight, but they've got nothing 
they've got no ground to stand on. They're gonna have to give it some fight, except except defeat. They're gonna have to give up the fight. This person's watching you a lot. Um, this person, <clears throat> excuse me. This person definitely could be secretly watching Tarot or getting readings done on you. Page of Swords reversed. Yeah, this person likes to gossip a lot also. What is this person doing, people? Page of Swords reversed. Yeah, they've got bad news. Whatever they're doing or saying to you recently um, or whatever drama they're trying to start, they're only doing this because they got bad news in their life. They're trying to bring your confidence down, um, get you to fold on your beliefs. They want you to be weak and timid and a pushover. They're trying to push you over or something of that nature, but they're only doing this because they got to move back home with family or their mom. Two of Cups, they want you to give up on some connection or relationship or um, some sort of, could be a friendship. They want you to give up on whoever you're in this Two of Cups energy with. They want you to put everything in your life aside, it looks like, and cater to them. This person is extremely, um, <laughs> extremely selfish, it looks like. Okay, and Page of Swords reversed. This person's very immature. They're still stuck on high school type of shit. They could have a high school mentality. Yeah, it's right there. You're very selfish. You're way too selfish. You're too vain. You're way too materialistic. You only care about things in life that don't truly matter. So this is um, whatever this is for you. So maybe that's your ex or whoever that is, jealous person from your past, your person's past. Okay, what is this person hiding secret, this angry person? They don't want to give in or compromise or accept something's over. Um, there's a big secret being hidden. What are they hiding overall in general, please? That they are trying to fuck with your mind. One up, okay. King of Pentacles. They're trying to do some sneaky shit for money. Okay, this person could be under investigation or you've been um, studying this person. Trying to get more information. King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. They're trying to get your pentacles, just period. Okay, just flat out. They're trying to find sneaky, deceptive ways to fuck with your mind. Five of Swords. I feel like it's not even a secret. <laughs> the moon reversed, yeah. It's not even a secret, you already know. Five of Swords. Yeah, they're trying to, um, this person's really jealous of a connection you have with someone else. Whatever intimate connection that is. They're trying to come in between that or they want you to give up on that or something like that. They want you to give up on your family. Family dynamic could want you to give up um, on supporting your kids, your child, children. I see kids here. This person wants you to put all that aside and cater to them. And there's a tower. They're getting ready to have um, a fall from grace if they have not already. This is somebody that's getting ready to move back. This is somebody very deceptive, lies a lot. Um, very manipulative, calculating, vindictive, spiteful. This is very evil. This is evil. This person is real evil, evil spirited, very completely selfish. This energy is, this person is real disgusting. Okay. Um, they're just going to have to move back home or find another place to live because you're real cold with them. They're only doing this for money. And I feel like you know that. Yeah. Justice, Libra. You're trying to bring balance to some situation in your life. It could be your health or your money. Maybe you're trying to get back on track financially. Maybe you could took some losses with this person. You're trying to collaborate and team up with somebody else. Could have something to do with a child too. Kids, some new love, new lover. You're putting yourself first either way. In this situation, I feel like you're no longer gonna be a doormat and let this person or people take advantage of you. That's all come to a close. They don't wanna accept something. Um, 
they're definitely getting bad karma. They just they feel like you're supposed to pay their 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 bills or assume their debts, assume their financial responsibilities. Um, and then yeah, they're gonna just have to move or find somewhere else to go or something or cut back on their lifestyle or something, make adjustments. They don't want to do that. They they don't they feel like they don't they're not supposed to have to do that. You're supposed to bend over backwards. Assuming another person's debts, financial responsibilities. Yeah, they want to be in this Nine of Cups energy. The selfish person, they want to be in this Nine of Cups energy. They got bad news coming for them. Um, strength reversed. They want they want you to be weak, weak-willed, so that they can be in this Nine of Cups, enjoying life, uh, being spoiled, living in uh, luxury. Okay, they, they feel like they're supposed to have that lifestyle. Yeah, they... <laughs> They feel like you're supposed to keep giving them money or providing for them. I see that's over though. Yeah, there's Ten of Pentacles, Queen of Wands. This could be somebody you know, Divine Femme. Um, or this is somebody that's trying to be in this Ten of Pentacles with you. Ten of Coins. They, they feel like they're supposed to receive gifts and be able to shop and stuff like that. And have extras and live in, in luxury and, and, and plenty on your dime. That's what I that's what I feel like. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Okay. Show me this energy, please. I feel like you're in this ten of pentacles either by yourself or um, somebody self-made. You're in this um, ten of pentacles either by yourself or with somebody else. Queen of Wands, ten of pentacles. It's not going to this person or people. You could be um, having a family, pregnancy, child outside of the marriage. You do not have to hide your emotions from me. So this could be a child, but you could have a child with somebody else. I, like I said, I see a pregnant woman here um, or a baby mama. There is a child or pregnancy or kids outside of this relationship or whatever this is. Somebody says, I'm praying for our child or children. Yeah, this is definitely, yeah, this is definitely about kids. You're putting some kids first. Whoever this is feels like you need to put them first. So this person is basically competing with your kids, basically, or your child or your baby mama or whoever this is. I'm focused on our child or children. Back with the ex. Somebody's back with the ex or getting back with the ex. So much has happened between us. Can we work it all out? Yeah, power couple. So you guys, this must be a couple outside of whoever this person that's angry. Power couple, king and queen vibes, money moves, business minded. Whoever the fuck this is is trying to take this ten of pentacles from y'all guys. They feel like they need a piece of the pie or they feel obligated entitled to that. <laughs> oh, Lord. I promise this person better get ready to pack up or whatever they're doing. Looks, yeah, they got to make a sacrifice. And this person got to go to their mama's house or wherever else. Yeah, they're mad because they got to go to their mom's. Queen of Swords reversed. The mom could be real evil the same way, real mean. Yeah. This is about somebody's mom. They hate their mom so much like that. Damn. Wow. Well, then why don't they become self-sufficient? Anywho, um... They want you to assume their responsibilities. This person hates their mom or don't get along with their mama. 